Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm joined with Patch Bits, and as you can see on the screen, we are messing around with the custom missile mod yet again, but not to make missiles or projectiles. We're actually going to be using the tracking function from the custom missile mod to make turrets that will automatically aim at each other, so we can make some really cool anti-air weapons. You ready, Patch? Yes! All right, let's do it. Okay, so first things first, we're actually going to need to actually build some kind of anti-air weapon, and I think we'll start off with a classic Sea Wiz. Yeah. Should be pretty easy to build a Sea Wiz. We just need one minigun, right? One minigun and a big dome. <laughs> yeah. Surely there can be no further complexity to this. Uh... <laughs> it's gonna be relatively simple because it is just a test. We gotta test this out first. Yeah, I'm thinking we might have to use anchor pins for this just to keep it to the ground or we just use a bunch of weights. I think either way will work. This is looking pretty good so far. It's a really simple, pretty easy thing to build. I doubt this will be actually able to shoot a plane out of the sky in Trailmakers uh, because one minigun won't do it. <laughs> it just won't have enough power. More firepower. Right, so we are going to need an eye for this. So I'm going to get the eyeball piece. Just slap that there. So this will be able to aim. And now I just got to build the rest of this base. Oh, I also need a rotating base. I am going to just use like a really heavy base though, I think, because uh, sometimes the anchor pins can get a little finicky. Okay, that's looking pretty good. Let's give it a paint job. Uh, we obviously need the white dome. And we got to keep this eyeball blue, I think, right? I think uh, it's this blue. Blue, some kind of... It should come up in the UI with some funky stuff if you have the right blue, I think. Yeah, I, ju I just set it to blue and it said in my UI, this is a target. I'm going to assume... Oh, okay, so it needs to be green. Yeah. Yeah, no, there we go. You're right. You asked at the start, you were like, which one is it? And I was like, oh, <laughs> oh it's green, surely. <laughs> okay, so green is the color we need to get this mod working. And I, like I said before, I need to lower the strength on all of the uh, servos here. Let's put 0.1. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, a firing Hopefully. mechanic. How are we going to get this thing to shoot? I just say, just have it instantly on all the time. I'm just going to put a, some kind of sensor in it and where it's going to fire constantly. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. There's our Sea Wiz. Now we need to set these targets. So let me give mine a save. I'm surprised it's not shooting itself. <laughs> okay, I've selected the green eyeball. And then we have all our settings here. I need to select a target, right? So if I go for other teams, I can even pick specific players. Patch bits. There we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think we need to increase the strength a little bit. I'm going to put the strength to 100. Activation distance, also 100. Oh, 1,000 apparently. And detection cone. Oh, look at that. It's, it's aiming at you, Patch. Yeah, mine's not. <laughs> oh no, it just does this. Oh. I don't know what it's doing. Wait, oh. so is it aiming at your build or aiming at you? Try moving your player. Uh, yeah, would you look at that? It's actually following him. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> I think the strength needs to be increased just a little bit. I think that will actually shoot down a plane. That most likely might damage a small plane. All right, we're going for a thousand strength. Oh my God, would you look at that? It's like a, has a mind of its own. <laughs> Get him. Oh, my poor, my poor build. It's not happy. <laughs> All right, Patch, I say to test out the Sea Wiz, get in a plane and let's see if it can shoot you down. Oh, oh you might, you might want to get out of here. Oh. It's not going to uh, let you take off. <laughs> uh, no. Free me. Oh, God. Uh, so uh. the range on the Sea Wiz is actually quite far. It's just the auto aim lock is, I think it's about 300 meters. So once you're within 300 meters, the auto aim will try and uh, predict where you're going to be and try and be a little bit more accurate. But look at this, guys. <laughs> Hello there. Oh gosh. Okay. Yeah. Is it's it hitting, hitting you? Nice. Is, yeah. I this is so cool. Move. It is. It's quite good actually. Oh yeah. It's definitely hitting you. Oh yeah. I wish it wasn't just like a burst. If it was like a yeah, constant could, fire, it would be so cool. If we could turn the miniguns onto like permanent shots. We need another mod for that. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, if it was doing a little bit more damage, I think I'd be out the sky by now, but uh, 
I think see. it's really working. Oh, yeah. This is so cool. It is, yeah. The uh, limiting factor here is miniguns. <laughs> <laughs> well, we can try with different variants of the Sea Wiz. And oh, there we go. There's the oh, wing. Yeah. So eventually it can take you down. But we definitely need some weapon upgrades to this. But the whole concept is working. 100% works, which is awesome. <laughs> there might be a way for me to like piston mesh another minigun into the spot i think all i gotta do is put this piston to start position zero and wow. yeah there we go there's two <laughs> miniguns piston glitched into there now i just need to i need to offset them Oh, that's that's decent. Nearly. Nearly, okay. What about 0.4? Is that a constant flow of fire? Oh, nearly. Oh. Uh, there's, there's a tiny there's gap. There's a tiny the two. gap, yeah. But it's definitely better. That's a lot better, yeah. All right, I'm going to put a seed on this for you to take and save and uh, select the target as me. And then I want to see what it's like to be shut down by this thing. I don't want to use a plane that's too durable. Ah, yes, a good old Spitfire. Oh, yeah, it's shooting me. It's shooting me. Okay. Oh, my yeah. God. It's, right. it's, aim it's, is it it's still aiming at now. me? <laughs> uh, this range? Yeah, yeah. 800 meters. That's no problem for it. Wow. Okay, let's do a fly pass. Let's see what happens. Oh, here comes the Sea Wiz. Oh, that's leading, I uh, think. Yep, Whoa. it's leading the shots. Oh, that's actually really accurate. Holy moly. <laughs> uh, the, the two guns have synced up. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, not that devastating. If I, if we were to put like blasters on, I think your wing would rip off instantly, which we will test out next. Yeah, there it goes. There's parts falling off. Ah, my wing! No! <laughs> Sweet victory. <laughs> I'm really enjoying messing with this. This is awesome. Having something to uh, track players like that is so cool. All right. I've took out all the uh, weaponized components and we're going to make the most devastating anti-air weapon that we can possibly make. Okay, guys, this is the new improved anti-air turret. We took some inspiration from like an old World War II black cannon, but it's basically modernized with a bunch of lasers and even an energy shield to protect the actual turret itself because maybe the enemies fire back. But have a look at this. It has two rockets, six lasers, four miniguns with a constant spray. Yeah, it is deadly. It is a force to be reckoned with. So let's set the player to patch bits again. <laughs> yeah, okay, it's working. Patch bits is now the target. So uh -oh. you might have to spawn elsewhere. Uh -oh. Yeah, you're going to have to spawn somewhere else. <laughs> this whole aircraft carrier is pretty protected. <laughs> What happens okay. if I spawn two? I will just keep this one for now. Look at that firepower. Oh, no. I'm, I'm already As soon as it's that. within auto aim range, you're gone. You're going to be toast. <laughs> Hello. Oh, oh there oh. it is. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> I just felt it like oh, snap. Oh, instantly man. shredded. Wow. I want to go against this thing. All right, I'm going to give you a seat. Okay, take that, patch bits. I'm going to try my best to actually take out the anti-air turret. Okay, I have my F-16. I'm taking off. Wonderful. I am, uh, you know, defending my carrier. Um, am I about to see some projectiles heading my way? I am. Look at that. Try to take my carrier, Mr. Bond. <laughs> I will. I'll take it. I'll take out this anti-air. It's really overpowered to be honest i only have two lasers and two rockets <laughs> yeah no. the thing is i don't know if i can get close you know what let's try it oh i'm gonna launch a rocket <laughs> get out of the way oh i'm hit i'm hit <laughs> oh my god yeah your rockets were nowhere now i'm afraid <laughs> it has that shield too so i gotta break through that first Oh, oh, I got a hit. Oh, oh my hey. God. No, I'm sh I've been shredded. I am being shredded. Uh oh, you uh -oh. damaged it. If that makes you feel any better. Uh, I mean, that would be cool, but I'm, I'm just, I'm in the sea. <laughs> you took off three of the fake <laughs> barrels. Great. I only took out the cosmetics. I'm going to come in for a low pass this time. It's already nearly hitting me. Oh, yeah, it is hitting me. Here we go. Low pass. 
Rocket. Oh, oh, oh my seat no. was shredded. No right way. In the seat. <laughs> and it's left little bits of F-16 all over the deck. <laughs> <laughs> I got one more strategy, like a straight vertical dive. That might work because it might get confused. Okay, yeah, it is trying to follow me with those projectiles. Oh, I'm pretty yeah, sure I'm above. Still, still We're diving. Here we go. I can't even see you. <laughs> yeah, it's hitting me. It's hitting me. Pull up, pull up, pull up. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't pull up in time. It's stuck, though. You've, you've genuinely, you've got it stuck on its back. It can't get up now. <laughs> So it just makes me wonder what else we can do with this mod with that tracking capabilities. Maybe we can make vehicles that can actually follow players and other builds and stuff. But yeah, I'm really glad we tested out the uh, capabilities more with the custom missile mod. Definitely leave your suggestions down below on what else we can try and maybe we can try some other mods. And whilst you're at it, why not consider subscribing? It's free. But anyway, that's enough from me and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.